In part three, Dr. Sebi, we would like to talk about alkaline, and we'd also like to talk about your natural vegetation cell food. Is it the same as the African bio-mineral balance? And as you address that question, can you also talk about the concept of alkaline? Alkalinity, not versus the African biobalance, but how do they compare? Well, they're one and the same. The African biomineral balance has to be constructed around an organic or alkali structure. Why? Because it is alkalinity that delivers the energy. There isn't a battery that man makes that is acid. It says alkali, there is energy. So alkalinity is what produces electricity. And since the human body is also electrical, and you're gonna feed it something dead, well, you have not done anything. You're gonna have to feed the body electric food. Uh, you find electric food, or in resonance of electricity, in what the geologists call native plants. Do you know that there is such word or such understanding, expression, a native plant? What is a native plant? A native plant is a plant that came with nature, that came with the creation of the planet. Not so for a non-native. What is a non-native plant, Dr. Sebi? A carrot, a bee, a beans. Why is that? Because they contain starch. And you, know, you will not find energy where there is acid. You find energy where there is alkalinity. Carrot acid, beans acid, rice is acid. So you see. We haven't begun to separate or draw the line of demarcation, separating that which is alkali from that which is non-alkali, which is acid. God, all the products of God are alkali. Because if God had made an acid substance, well now God, what are you talking about? What are you doing? What's your game? That you're going to feed me acid food? No. God is merciful. God only produced alkali food. Alkali food you find in Africa before the invasion, before the occupation, before the Arabs or the Europeans went to Africa, there was nothing but alkali food. Why? Because the African didn't indulge in separating plants to create a hybrid that would be acid base. You call that cross-pollination or hybridization. These are the things that are practiced in Europe, China, Japan, not in Africa. We didn't do that. We obey God as it was presented to us. Now tell us about your natural vegetation cell food. Is it the same as the African bio-mineral balance? That expression was not, was not for me. That expression came from a group of white people from Lancaster, Pennsylvania. When they heard that I was arrested and I had been doing business with them for many years, they knew that my product weren't acid-based, they were not oxide, they weren't chemicals, and they weren't medicine. So they called me from Lancaster, Pennsylvania, and they said, Dr. Sebi, could we come and become a witness in your favor? I said, of course. Well, we want you to know that your substance, we analyze them in our laboratory, and your substance should be considered natural vegetation cell food. They, Lancaster Laboratories, are the leading laboratories in the world in reference to organic and biological research. And they gave me that. They were the ones that went to the Supreme Court because the Attorney General 
and Dr. Victor Herbert said that if my compound cured people, they should be categorized as medicine. Lancaster Laboratory said, hold it, not so. There is nothing in his compound that should be considered medicine. It is all organic. It is natural vegetation, cell food. Very good. 